Sky TV shares sync on Rugby World Cup loss. Television New Zealand and Spark may have wrestled the rights to the next Rugby World Cup away from Sky Television. Sky announced it was not the preferred bidder to broadcast the Rugby World Cup in 2019. Its shares slumped 8% when trading opened on the NZX, on the news. Spark and Television New Zealand are understood to have agreed to put in a joint bid for the broadcasting rights, but would not comment on whether they had been told they had been successful. Assuming they do win rights to the event, it is expected Spark would be likely to stream matches over the internet, with TV and Z providing free-to-air coverage. Spark spokesman Andrew Perry said it was not in a position to comment. Television New Zealand spokeswoman Georgie Hills also said it was not in a position to comment. The world's premier rugby event will be held over six weeks in Japan between September and November in 2019. Sky TV chief executive John Fellett said on Tuesday that he thought Sky had a better than evens chance of keeping rugby rights for the next 15 years, but he clarified he was referring to Super Rugby which it films. Fellett said the Rugby World Cup was not such a good proposition for Sky because the closing stages of the competition, when interest was highest, had to be shown free to air. By the time he put the quarter-final, semi-final and the final all live on free-to-air, there really isn't much of a sky advantage. The real value is free-to-air and it is tough to make much of a meal out of things like All Blacks vs Tonga in a pool play. I'm not denigrating the event it's fantastic and we'd love to have it. Fellett said he would not be surprised if TV and Z and Spark won the rights. Sky's bid was still live, but he had never seen rights awarded to a contender that was not the preferred bidder, he said. Sky was also vulnerable to being outbid for end-of-year All Blacks tours, Fellett said. Sky said in a statement to the NZX that it was an economic reality that it couldn't have every match of every sport that New Zealanders like to watch. Rugby World Cup rights are sold by IMG Media on behalf of Rugby World Cup Limited. At 10. Thirty M Sky shares were trading seven percent at two dollars.